In Psalms chapter 90, verse 10, the writer says, As for the days of our life, they contain 70 years, or, if due to strength, 80 years. Yet their pride is but labor and sorrow, for soon it is gone and we fly away. These words were written 2,700 years ago. Almost three millennium ago, the writer observes that man's lifespan is about 70 to 80 years. Today, with all the advances of modern medicine, doctors tell us that the average lifespan is 75.8 years. Now, when we compare these two pieces of information, we learn three important lessons. First of all, God is the one who is in charge of life. He establishes the extent of our lifespan. Man, no matter how hard he tries, cannot change the border of his life. I believe that through his kindness, God has allowed us to discover ways to relieve the suffering that we experience during that 75.8 years, but not to double the 75.8 years to 150 or beyond. Secondly, our lifespan should serve as a constant reminder that one day we have to face death and judgment that will come soon after. A brief life, 75 years, goes by in a hurry. A brief life should inject a sense of urgency in getting our priorities right and investing our time and energy in the proper way. Great men and women were those who knew that they only had so much time and did not waste it. For example, Philip, the father of Alexander the Great, would have his servant wake him up in the morning by whispering in his ear, you are going to die. And then, finally, in the end, resurrection is all that counts. If the resurrection is true, we have hope. If it is not true, then all we have is about 75.8 years.